in between the larynx up here and the major primary bronchi which go to each lung we have the trachea the trachea is supported by c-shaped rings of cartilage these c-shaped rings of cartilage are open on the back side uh, so we'll be able to see that later when we look at the posterior side of the trachea the rings are connected to one another by a ligament which is referred to as the annular ligaments in between each ring as we go up uh, look up and down uh, the trachea here is a posterior view of the trachea and you can see as we zoom in and look more closely that there is an absence of cartilage in the posterior side of the trachea and this is where you would find the trachealis muscle so you would find soft tissue right over here holding the ends of the c-shaped rings of cartilage uh, together and the trachealis muscle which is a smooth muscle and would be uh, attaching these ends to one another and would be able to control the di diameter of the trachea uh, when, uh, by contracting or relaxing. Right over here where the trachea bifurcates or forks there is a bridge where you have this division taking place in between where this, the, the two bronchi go there each their own way uh, would be called the carina. So the carina is located right over here in this region, right behind this metal prong. And the word carina literally means keel. So it kind of looks like the keel of a boat.